capable of flying undetected in restricted airspace and of carrying deadly payloads with no risk to the operator, drones provide military forces with a unique set of challenges and opportunities. On Friday, the US held its largest counter-drone technology demonstration at Naval Base Ventura County in California. The demonstration, dubbed Black Dart, involved simulated demonstrations of unmanned aircraft systems, or UAS, to test defense capabilities. Law enforcement agencies in the U.S. say the threat of drone attack is increasing. Just last week, reportedly in response to three drone sightings at JFK Airport in New York, the U.S. Department of Homeland Security issued a bulletin to police agencies warning that the rising trend in UAS incidents within the national airspace system will continue as UAS gain wider appeal with recreational users and commercial applications. It said while many of these encounters are not malicious in nature, they underscore potential security vulnerabilities that could be used by adversaries to leverage UAS as part of an attack. Yeah, I don't. I don't think we need to look any further than news reports in just the last several weeks uh, and months to to understand why it's so critical. It's certainly critical to our fielded forces who are deployed overseas, uh, in terms of the very small UAS that might be uh, a, a direct threat to fielded forces, as well as uh, UAS that are used in a intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance type of role. Here at home. We have this, the very same concern, so it's, it's not a, a military or, or civilian threat that's different. It's a shared concern uh, because they can, they can be harmful to all of us, uh, regardless of where we are. The Black Dart exercise involved around 1,000 people and more than 55 systems. The military hopes demonstrations like these will help forces to detect, identify and classify drones and counter the threat of unmanned attack from the air.